What's up guys? I haven't ice fished in a while. First time perch fishing all year because it takes tracks. Everybody's got the tracks getting fired up. It's a little breezy today, but uh, it's probably like 33 right now, a little melty. I see one guy on the lake. We'll see what we can do, get set up, and uh, finally get some perch on the air. Giants, man. This is good. Yeah. 47 Minnesota. Exactly. Here we go. This one's a little better. This looks a lot better. Yeah. Yeah, this is a good one. That's the ones we're after right there. I'm just using my tuned up custom rod, my same tumbler spoon, the pink, and waxies. That's funny. There we go. There we go. I don't know that it's very big, but. Well, I gotta keep tension, man. Well, North Dakota gold right there. There we go. Nice one. Yeah, you took me with so I could take pictures of you today. Yeah, Catching a huge fish. Got to take over? I don't think so. Push it. Push it a little bit. <sighs> Boy, that's some nice North Dakota gold. Yeah? Look at those. That's gotta be the biggest one yet. Put a bobber down. Never gets old. Yeah, the old eye. You got him? Yeah. Hold him there for a second. Let's see if we can get him. <laughs> it's too, too wiggly. He doesn't want to, yeah. There you go. Nice one. Oh, oh, oh baby. Oh, jeez. Ready for bobber holes yet? Yeah. Woo. How far off the bottom are you with it right on it? Is that? This one might be one of the fatter ones. Maybe the biggest one. I just said it was little. Hold that pig up. Oh, that one. Holy smokes. Yeah. Finally. Good one? I don't think so. I'll take them though. 
What's that? Let me know if you need me. Always need you. <laughs> Just waiting for you to fall off the bucket, what is it? I mean, it's not huge. You hit harder than... Yeah, it looks like you really bent down. Yeah. That was like the last two I caught. I wasn't ready for him, that's for sure. <laughs> Got him. Hell no. Heck no. That little dink. Oh, struggling today. Might be okay. He's up another night nice. Nice keeper. Nice keeper. It's been a little while. He's not near as big as those other jumbos, though, is he? Nope. Hi, 10 inch. We'll clean up. Got these little prairie pothole. They got uh, leeches on them. Is it poop? Yeah, look at it compared to the other ones, though. Yeah. That's a nice mess of fish. Heck yeah. It'll clean up nice. It will clean up nice. It's like crazy right now. There's a nice keeper, huh? Did you? This one will work. Oh, yeah. Let me see what I got here. This one's not quite as big, but it's nice. You gotta do eight or nine, you might as well do 20, right? Boy, they hit the minnows like, like that. He's messing with it pretty hard. I just got a dinky one. Let's see what happens here on this bobber going crazy. Just commenting how there's big ones and there's a bunch of little ones too. And how it means a healthy fishery. Maybe the snow has helped it from being outfished, but... We've got some 13 inchers and we're getting, oh, this is probably like seven. Actually, gonna save the minnow. We're a little short. But to see all kinds of sizes of fishes means the big one's got something neat and the little ones are, are making it too, or there's a good reproducing population. So hopefully this is a good fishery for years to come. Just a mess trying to fish a bunch of lines outside in the bright snow. See, I got my sun protector on because I'll probably still end up with a red nose. And nobody for miles. We saw one guy on our way in, so it's good to see that people are trying to enjoy the outdoors. It's just the access is terrible. I think I got it. No, what I did is I spooled around my line, not I had it laid down. He's okay. Probably just a little under keeper size. Let that one go. Nope. No, okay. that's a good one. Oh yeah. No, you're fine. That's a good one. Look at that, running. I'm okay, man. I'm already on my knees. See, you lose them. Or not lose them. Can't see now. Turn my light. It's okay. That's not good enough. Look at that. Those are nice fish. A keeper. Those are real nice fish. Right in the lip, too. I would classify this as another jumbo. Not as big as some of the other ones, but man, look at that. That's a good fish. I can't believe this is the first time I've perched fish this year. Right in the sunlight. Oh yeah, nice pretty color. I'll take about a dozen of those home between us and cook some perch up this weekend. This is going to be minnow wax worm in that, that tumbler. I got him. <laughs> Bait. Can't have my minnow though. Just slowly, slowly down. Got him though. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. 
Oh ja. Ja. Yeah. Dat is een jumbo. Dead minnow too. See how it's oh, I don't think he's very big. Oh, he might be okay. He's okay. Not great. What's that? Yeah, he'll eat alright. Still keep my same minnow. All right, let's see there. Grab this, grab that. All right, about ready to stop filming for the day just for the fact that my batteries are all cold and I'm about done. We got 14 jumbos in the bucket from, oh, the small side are probably 11. The big ones are over 13. So pretty fantastic day. Uh, jumbo fer perch fishing North Dakota. Come look at the bucket here real quick. And that is a girthy perch. It's gonna be good eating. See if we can catch a few more before we go, but like I said, I'm basically done filming, trying to see. It's so bright, I can't see, covered up, it's breezy. Hopefully you can hear this with dead cat on. End it for the day, might come back out again. Thanks for following along. See you later. You want last good one of the day? Mm, let me get off, he's about a niner. Poor already. That's right. I'm gonna catch him. What's this right here? That first ticker. Yeah. yeah.